Expelled AIADM ke leader VK Shashikala was officially released from a Bengaluru prison after completion of her four-year jail term in a disproportionate assets case in which former chief minister late Jay Jay Lalita was also convicted in 2016. But Shashikala's return is being touted as crucial to rebalancing and realignment of the AIADM ke just before the Tamil Nadu elections. So how significant is her return? BJP is supporting the idea that you know Shashikala may be taken back to to the ADMK or ADMK alliance but uh, Edapadi K Palanisamy the chief minister he clearly said that there is no room for Shashikala in ADMK there is he completely ruled out the chances of Shashikala returning back to the party so what makes Shashikala significant uh, what will what can Shashikala do after spending 4 4 years in jail Uh, in her absence her nephew ttv dinagaran he formed a party ammk and that party uh, contested in 2019 election they had little more than 4% vote which, which is considered uh, maybe about 15% of admk votes so uh, consolidating maximum admk votes uh, including that uh, you know that that who are who are supporting sesigala faction now so that is going to be very crucial uh, for for both bjp and admk but at the same time bjp worries that uh, you know their main concern is to defeat admk the the dravid dominator karagam of mk stalin uh, the the prime enemy for admk leadership for uh, edapadi as well as o paneer selvam uh, it is also about uh, keeping control over the party Uh, uh irrespective of the poll results so they 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 fear that they have reasons to fear that uh, shashikala may take over party uh, after polls so when there were negotiations between shashikala and admk camp uh, about about her possible return fr- to the to the to the uh, camp uh, the condition uh, the proposed condition was that shashikala will take over the party and edapadi can run the government but edapadi fears that if the government is defeated in the election what will happen uh, the party might you know party will be under the control of shashikala and and he will be forced to work under her so that that is reportedly one of the main reasons uh, for edapadi k palaniswami to uh, reject the idea even after bjp had uh, proposed it Uh, we know that uh, rss id log s gurumurthy he claimed once that you know he was the person who uh, advised o paneer selvam to go for a revolt against shashikala in 2017 after after jailudas death even gurumurthy also uh, 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 suggesting that you know uh, he sounded uh, to a similar argument that uh, why not shashikala come on board when the main enemy to be defeated is dmk so uh the the return of shashikala from prison is very crucial in tamil nadu election and and it may be having its own importance for admk also in 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 deciding their destiny Uh, so so when it when it comes to shashikala loyalists in admk of course there are a lot of loyalists uh, there are ministers and nobody will speak because uh, for two reasons one for to to protect their positions in the government and uh, of course they 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 had reasons to be afraid of uh, raids so at this point when bjp is supporting the idea of uh, shashikala's alliance or shashikala coming back to admk there may be uh, people who will uh come out and talk before elections it is it is expected from many many corners uh that there will be uh, there may be ministers there may be mlas there may be district functionaries who may be uh countering uh, uh, chief minister edapadi k palani swami's uh position that you know shashikala cannot return in this election if shashikala is not going to uh, get a chance i mean get a room in admk if they don't uh, get a space in the admk bjp alliance uh, it is most likely uh, ttv dinagaran samk will be forming 
uh, a third front uh, and 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 that is most likely to happen so in in other way uh, 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 who wants to uh, form a third front you know third front is going to be a very uh, tiring uh, process because you have to uh, fight a campaign on alone and you need to have candidates in maximum seats uh, you should have more parties in their in your fold and that cannot be contrary to your earlier positions and also so we have to wait and see how difficult it is for uh, sasigala uh, to to form a third front dmk already is dmk already has a very very advantageous position because they have a very strong alliance in 2016 even if they were defeat, defeated it was one of the most powerful uh, opposition uh, camp uh, ever in the state uh, sachigala is not taken back to admk uh, in that case uh, definitely dmk uh, and admk will have a third front a powerful th- third front in the election and uh, that is definitely going to help dmk because uh, that will split pro government odds